we would like to start with few questions in our mind please stay tuned with us for the sake of our nation Suppose you offer me a cup of coffee to drink with love and affection but in return we disrespect your love and affection by throwing it on the ground and wasted it how would you feel about me good or bad of course bad suppose you give me a beautiful shirt for wearing i use it for cleaning my bike would you ever give me anything again yes or no Of course no suppose a father takes loan for his daughter's marriage and sends her to a good environment and good culture and good family but she messes up with the family members she argues she fights and lives unhappy there how would a father feel about his daughter proud or guilty happy or sad of course guilty and sad We took an example of coffee. I think coffee is privilege and higher quality of drink. I want to relate with coffee, higher quality of life. Which our government provides us in forms of good roads, electricity, public transports, medical facilities, and so many other things. Not only this, I would also speak about our natural resources like air, water. and land like i misbehaved with coffee i threw it on the ground and wasted it in the same manner we human beings have a tendency to misbehave with our resources and destroy them we tear the seat covers of public transport and spit there we make public toilets and railway toilets unreasonably dirty we break the traffic rules Not only this, we waste liters of water on cleaning our bikes, on cleaning our cars. We use lot of plastic bags and we throw the garbage, and that harm the environment. And then we foolishly cry out, saying we have lack of resources and poor facilities. In the second example, I mentioned a shirt. What is the utility of shirt? It hides our nudity. it makes us civilized and look presentable i relate shirt with the education as i showed this courtesy with the shirt people generally have a tendency to show this courtesy with the teachers we don't respect our teachers and we don't spend our quality time with books and we only run after so called certificates and degrees and that's how we will not become truly educated i would like to add our third point here you know what our government has taken 168 crore rupees loan from world bank for making our country digital india it has provided us good culture good environment in form of mobile and internet and a great information and world class ideas are few searches away from us now but we don't make any such searches usually we spend our time in watching amit bhana videos and sapra choudhary songs kari manathi and dhinchak puja sounds to be ideal personalities to us and not only this we spend our important hours of the day in tiktok tinder insta and facebook and in this manner our life book remains empty that's how we mess up with the gift given to us friends being proud citizen of this nation being true citizen of this nation we want to request you to take the responsibility of our behavior we should learn to value our resources our nature we should learn to protect them we should learn to honor the efforts of our government for the development of our nation friends we should learn to use and take benefit of these gifts 
to educate us and make ourselves superhuman because the power of nation lies in its people and if we become superhumans our country will become super power jai hind jai bharat